quite officially opening the retreat this morning the archbishop of church of uganda the most reverend dr stephen samuel kazimba mugaru commended the chancellors for their dedicated pro bono legal service to the church i am really so grateful to god for the gathering of the chancellors of all the 39 dioceses of the church of uganda and uh, these chancellors are the one in charge of legal matters to guide the church in uh, legal matters and uh, they are here also to be uh, um, trained uh, training or learning does not stop they are learned friends but they continue to learn and so this is actually uh, to help them to to be well conversant with the canon laws because they are secular laws secular laws that is what they learn in schools and their daily practices but now they have to advise the church the church is dealing with the canon laws he noted that chancellors play a crucial role in ensuring that church is governed in accordance with the laws of the church of uganda under the provincial constitution and provincial canons and abide by the laws of uganda chancellors are here to be helped to to be well conversant with these uh, church of uganda uh, documents and you have also received um, a trainer from america uh Reverend Canon Dr uh Philip Asher who is a reverend but also uh a lawyer who was trained in both uh and he's here to help us to definitely get uh, well acquainted to be well acquainted with the, the secular laws and also the canon laws. He further noted that the chancellors will get to know what's happening in other regions through networking and also discussing important matters concerning the church. But also this is good for connection that all the chancellors they get to know what is happening in Sebei, uh, how about uh, Mohabula, how about Mbale, North Mbale, Buhugu, then this side of uh, Nosankole, how about Kalamoja, or Calcotido, all this, this is a good, a good time for fellowship and learning together, but also sharpening each other, and this is really very, very important. So we are grateful that uh, this is uh, well arranged by the provincial chancellor and also secretariat to ensure that we have these two days set aside. And also, they will be discussing important matters connected to the church, transitions, things to do with the uh, revisiting of, uh, of the constitution of the Church of Uganda. According to Mr. Naboth Mheirwe, the provincial chancellor, the retreat is meant to strengthen the governance of the church and provide an opportunity for diocesan chancellors to network and share experiences from different dioceses. We, uh, we intend to use this time also to share our experiences from um, each, each of the dioceses so that uh, we can easily network and uh, see how to resolve some of the issues that have come up uh, today in, uh, in the province. We hope that at the end of the day, we'll be able to achieve uh, unity uh, in the church. And uh, one also important aspect is that we are also training in canon law. The lead facilitator of the retreat is Reverend Canon Dr. Phil Ashe, the president of the American Anglican Council, one of the founding bodies of the Anglican Church in North America. Canon Ashe is a former prosecutor and criminal practitioner in California, USA. He helped to draft the constitution and the canons of the Anglican Church of North America in 2008-2009 and continues to lead the Anglican Church of North America Committee for Governance. Julius Momza, Church of Uganda Family TV, News at 8.